A big week ahead on the Detroit River. Starting this Thursday, the Bayview Yacht Club is going to host the third annual Detroit Cup, an international match racing regatta. Recently, I had a chance to ride along with Chris and John Van Toll, the top-ranked match racing team in the United States, as they prepared for this week's competition. A learning experience for sure. It doesn't take long to realize match racing is a different animal. Intimate, nerve-wracking, a frenzied fury of split-second decisions. As a 20-year-old, I started match racing, and all of us who were involved just loved match racing. We raced whenever we could. It's a very aggressive sport. Up, up, up! At the end of the race, everybody's fine. They'll have a beer together. It's fierce on the water. It's not a flag. An umpire is assigned to each race, and on the spot, judge and jury for controversial moves that have to be flagged by the sailors. Flag. Rather than when you have an infraction out on the water, having to go into a protest room and go before a judge, they do it right out on the water, just like uh, watching baseball or football. Most of the legs are about a half a mile, and uh, it's twice around, so we're talking about 20 minutes. Penalties, devastating. All the way up. All the way up. Penalty is definitely devastating. When you're out there, what's the biggest element that you need to keep in mind Three, at all times? Two, one, five minutes. I think probably staying just calm on the boat. You know, you've got one other boat, so your focus is always just on trying to beat that one other boat. At the same time, if you can keep things simple, keep everybody calm on the boat, we usually have our best regattas. This year's regatta consists of 12 boats, six from the U.S., six from around the world. And the international reaction at first is what you'd expect. When everybody gets here, they're a little bit surprised that they're coming to Detroit for sailing. <laughs> um, but usually you see everybody by the end of the week has a big smile on their face. Everybody always has a great time when they come here. They love Detroit. They love the river. The river is a lot different than any other venue that they've been in. A lot of times they're racing out in the ocean or out in a lake. The river is so small. Small confines, but big stakes as racers can springboard 20 spots in the world rankings with a good showing. It's a big deal because we have some of the best match racers in the world coming to Bayview. When we invite these people and they come, it really says a lot about the club and our venue. Because of its intimate setup, the racing, unlike most other regattas, is perfect for fans. For the most part, when the wind is right, we can put it right out in front. We have bleachers on the front lawn. It is open to the public. Anybody can come down. No tickets required. We can hear cheering on the water. You know, we're only 50 yards offshore uh, at any given point during the start. Got to keep clear. You don't get that. Go ahead to win. To hear your own members cheering for you and to have two local teams in the regatta is a pretty cool thing. Here's what you need to know. The action's going to get going at 10 a.m. this Thursday. Admission is free. It runs through Sunday. You can get all the details you need at DetroitCup.com.